Now, it's fair to say a lot is happening in London as we speak, but British Prime Minister Theresa May has survived a no-confidence vote in the House of Commons. We just uh, got this news within the past half an hour or so after some of members of her own Conservative Party uh, questioned her ability to handle uh, Brexit, a very tough challenge. Everyone agrees on that. Let's get more on this and other news from around the world from our Noah Adam. So, Adam, just fill us in on the latest. Well, Mark, it was widely expected that May would survive the secret vote. 200 votes were cast in favour of the Prime Minister, while 117 were against. So that is quite a significant number. She will remain the Tory leader, at least for now. She's safe from another challenge from within her own party for the next uh, 12 months. But ahead of the vote, she did say she will step down before the next parliamentary election, which is due in the year 2022. Speaking after the results, May said she had listened to those who voted against her and that she needed to get on with the job of delivering Brexit. The tough task of getting her Brexit deal passed through Parliament still remains. MPs have publicly said they will vote it down. If the divorce agreement does not go through, then it's all back to square one, with only a few months left until the UK is scheduled to leave the EU on March the 29th. There are suggestions of the possibility of a no-deal scenario, though the majority of MPs do not wish for that to happen. There have also been calls for another referendum on Brexit, but London has ruled that out also. Mrs May will head back to Brussels on Wednesday to try and get reassurances on the agreement, especially on the so-called backstop issue, the key sticking point in the tumultuous uh, Brexit process.